All right, so I'm able to actually do this conclusion and not the other conclusion. The other conclusion is going to happen later. So, as you can see in Sun and I mean Sword and Shield. Sorry, Sword and Shield. In Shield, you have a Ghost Gym and you have an Ice Gym. In Sword, you have a Fighting Gym and a Rock Gym. Crazy enough, they share similarities, of course. And I would have kind of actually thought is a good idea to actually just trade off, you know? Why not? You could have just traded off to where, instead of being an exact sequence, you could have had the fighting gym be where the rock gym is, the rock gym where is the fighting gym is. You understand what I'm saying. It's that the sequence is a little bit different instead of being like, oh, I played the other one. I know exactly what to do. It's like, yeah, it's technically like that. So... Is it bad that they couldn't actually think of another gimmick? It's cool how they actually just changed it, you know? And as for the Rock one, I think technically, in a way, the Rock one is kind of more than the Ice one. Even though the Ice one, we already been through that before, right? Excuse me. We've been through that before with a couple of Ice Gems. Oh, yes. It was in Sinnoh. Yeah, the Ice Gym in Sinnoh did do that thing of where you actually have to... Was it? Or it could have been Pierce. It might have just been Pierce from Johto. Either way, I'm just saying, am I sad that it's the same exact thing that we've seen here? Mm, not really. I mean, look at the amazing twist. I saw the twist that happened when it came to the fighting gym. Because in the ghost gym, it's like, ooh, creepy hand. On the fighting gym, it's like boxing glove, boxing glove, boxing glove. And it looks like crazy enough that the Giga, the Giga Max forms, they made sure that the Giga Max forms are in each of them, where you had Gengar and you had Monchamp. While in this one, did they have a Giga form? I'm not sure. But even so, it's not that bad. And I am going to see what the Rock Gym holds, which is most likely nothing. Oh, side note, the Fairy Gym. Oh my gosh, doing it the second time, it's like... It's pretty funny because if you actually let the battle go on and on and on, she actually will just start doing some crazy funny stuff. Like, for instance, what is my age? And it's like, oh, yeah, you're 88. And he's like, oh, you didn't have to be honest about it. You could have do some flattery. It's like you should have picked 16 and then oh, lowering it. It's like, ah, oh, my gosh, man. Yeah, but it's kind of cool and all. But, of course, in the end, even if you try to get all the answers correct, of course you're not going to become the fairy type, the fairy gym leader. It's, of course, B-Day. It's like, yeah, it's him. He It was always him. It's like you just had to notice. Well, anyways.